everyone, I'm Nixie and welcome back to The Quarry uh, where we are just seeing who we can keep alive, who dies, all of that good stuff. Uh, we did the prologue and chapter 1 I think in our last video so let's go ahead and crack out and let's start seeing some action. Trees or dare? A very stereotypical uh, camp game. Oh, there's a general store here. I suppose that would make sense. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? Oh yeah, because Jacob, the idiot, uh, sabotage the car. Al Jacob. Rich and full body, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Well. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm almost there, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. Should we kick the door? You could do it. Ah, there we go. And Viola. Uh, your hair clip, madam. Yeah. Viola? It's not too shabby, huh? Yeah. Not voila. Um, let's be playful. I like a man who's good with his hands. All right, Emma. Uh, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Hopefully in the fridge. Beep, 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 beep. What beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beard art, dude. I'm just gonna- My beard art, dude. <laughs> wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Except for the melons. Mr. H loved his accessories. <laughs> think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> oh. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh. Jackpot. Hey, uh Check out my giant melons. Oh, God, you saved me, Charles. See, you just cut a hole in it? Mm hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah. It's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, er, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. <laughs> good choice, Admin. Good choice. There's cages. Huh. Okay, let's see what we can find. See if we can find the safe code. Do you think we'll be able to? God, there's like nothing in here. What's this? Ah, oh, harem scarum again. Harem scarum? We um, saw this in the very beginning, yeah, there. Um, these flyers are promoted in a travelling show called Home of Scaring. The, data, the date listed indicates that it took place over six years ago. Oh. Uh, these are the same posters in the world. Why does Chris Hackett have them or was he connected to Home of Scaring in some way? Oh, okay, can we... We can't do that with anything else. Uh, 
Whatever these posters are doing increase Hackett's possession, he must have got forgotten to take this one down. something in the distance? Just sunlight. Anything on these shelves? Nope. Um, yeah, I know that I'm going to miss like loads of stuff. Who buys this crap? <laughs> Someone will. Jeebus. You didn't see that? Anything? Okay. Mm -hmm, nothing. Ah. Scary mask. <laughs> Hello, old friends. Oh, yeah. Um, it would be kind of funny to scare him, but maybe just like leave them. Maybe I should give the guy a break. Mm. Answer first before I'm like going. What's this? A map? Blueprints. Um, blueprints for structural repairs on the lodger's chimney column. Judging by the scrawled annotations, this is not something Chris Hackett adds the money to your action right now. Okay. Is something going to happen with the chimney? Was there something here? Let's go into that room then. I wonder where this goes. Locked. <laughs> um, call Jacob maybe? Jacob! Come check this out. Maybe he can help? Uh, oh, oh, oh. all righty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Does he get in there? Done. <laughs> <Nice>. Yes. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. What is it? Fucking mother love. Good golly, Miss Molly. More melons. I wonder if kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we made his stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um... <clears throat> human rights, or... Whatever. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Now, let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Hell yeah. In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. Yes. Let's do a little bit of snoopy snoopy sin. Empty box. Cool. <laughs> Jacob! 
Check this out. What? I can't move or else the door will latch. They look like camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Torn bags. Uh, torn hiking bags dashed with flecks of dried blood. Okay. A bear do this? I think if it was bear, there'd be like nothing left. Oh, cool. What? Take Wait. it. <laughs> a gun. Oh, cool. And a uh, code. Is that for the safe? 7739. Remember that? 7739. Oh, God. I'm, uh, <laughs> okay. I'm done. Okay, cool. <laughs> yes, she took it. Okay, well, I think that literally is it then, maybe? Right? There's nothing in the box. Nothing in the freezer. There's camping things. Nothing around here. Do you want to take some snacks? I would absolutely want to take some snacks. Okay, let's go then. Oh. So you're, uh... You're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah, for bears. <laughs> okay, uh, well, I am gonna find something to haul this lot back to camp. You're gonna find something to take it back to camp? Well, I don't think you really need to use anything specific except for your arms. Let's go in here, because we didn't come this way. Maybe there isn't. Is that something? Just the light? Okay. Okay. Shortcut. Alright. Oh, the safe. Oh, she's doing it anyway. Okay, cool. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> what we got? Bullets? Yeah, shower. What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. Destruction? Take the fireworks. You know, you're right. Fireworks. <laughs> yeah, 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 hell yeah. Oh fireworks. god, it always makes oh, me nervous when he um, says past treason. Just had, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I found these like torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. He's not listening. <sighs> oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. Well, I don't like peanut butter. Um, aren't those kids are uh, butter well, pops? What are butter pops? <laughs> no. What? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um, <clears throat> pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack. Are oh, they in date? What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No. No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing. Like their own subgenre of food snack. Are they you know an what? actual I thing? I've had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that? <laughs> right. Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old. Okay. They? Look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. Well, you're gonna love them. No, thank you. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. You're already taking a uh, case of beers. Sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds. <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. 
Um, okay. Uh, you didn't know we were it's like um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just weave it around. Oh, I see. She doesn't know what one is. I suppose he said wheel. Did he say wheelbarrow? Mm, not wheelbarrow. Which way? Yeah, he called it a wheelbarrow, not a wheelbarrow. No wonder she questioned him then. It's like a barrel with wheels. <laughs> All right. The inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure. Just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Ah, oh, charging the phones. Okay. Podcasts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. All good. Yeah. Uh, friendly. Let's be nice uh, to people. What's it called? The one that you're listening to right now. Uh, bizarre yet bona fide. So like ghosts and stuff. It's like um, yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're well, bona fide. <laughs> bona fide. <laughs> Why is it most so overcharged with this? Your wit knows no bounds. Right. So, should Typical we check lots. out Mister H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on. What kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? <laughs> Not Mr. H. I know. He's cool. It's always been cool to me. Are we going to have a look around anyway? I guess so. I'll try to nothing. Can't you like speed it up at all? I can try to encourage them. Go for it. You guys can do it. It's not working. <laughs> We're gonna have to wait. <laughs> so my kind of timetable. Trash. Whoa! Look at this old thing. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? Flirt with them. I feel like uh, this would so be Dylan's response. So that I can ask you out on a date. Uh, mm, smooth. I think if I try to cell phone number. Ryan seems interested. Hello? What? What? Who is it? Uh, hello. It's weird. I thought I heard someone. Hmm. Maybe you should have asked them out on a date. <laughs> Damn it! I missed my shot. <laughs> Ryan seemed interested. Hello. Family photo. We saw this uh, a little while ago, didn't we? Like in our last video. A younger looking camp leader, Chris Hackett, with his two kids, Caleb and Kaylee. They look happy. I am. Um... Where was that family photo? Um... The one thing that, like, I kind of don't like is that you can't like um um zoom in on the thing like to have a look at it properly like in some of the like other games Kaylee and Caleb Hackett weird kids huh I like them yeah me, I, me too um they're pretty reclusive you have to admit I don't think there's anything wrong with that. A secret little hatch? Is there anything else? Gun? Okay. Well, hello, what is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? You're gonna open it. Secret sex dungeon. I feel like that's something that he would say. Suspicious. Uh, I guess he goes to the basement. 
Um, I feel like in reality he would say secret sex dungeon, but let's be suspicious. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. Huh. But why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Maybe it was here before this was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. It's probably for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Oh, uh, okay. Or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. What is that? All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so. You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You opened it, you climb down. Path chosen. Oh god, what is it? Is it gonna be like a body under here? What's down there? Oh my god, Ryan, you will what? not believe this. What, what, what? It's nothing. I had you go in there for a second, didn't I? No. Maybe. <laughs> Shut up. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so... Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. Okay... Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> Can we look at the other things, though? Ringy dingy ding. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta take this one second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression of Mr. H? Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I, you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. <laughs> okay. Can we have a look at the other, like, things, though? What is it? His diary. Oh. Laura Kearney and Max Brindley. Ah. Oh, yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. They did. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Okay. Um, a list of counselors' names, personal details, and their tasks at camp. Two names are crossed out Laura and Max. So why didn't they show up? Oh, they did. Actually, what happened to them? Did they just get killed off? Okay, cool. Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris, Mr. H told me it was for, um, bears. Bears? Here? Yeah, yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun. Yeah. Uh -huh. Take it. Just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. What if we need that? Yeah, what if we need that? Dude, what if we're out partying tonight out in the woods and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah, yeah. What I mean, think about it. It's camp is over and hunting season has just begun. True. What if? What if? Okay, bear with me here. What if what's on the menu tonight is us? Well, then I guess we would need to protect ourselves. Exactly. That's why we need the gun mm. for protection. Yeah, not gonna happen. What about for fun? No. Okay. Yep. Yep. Totally. You're not gonna take it. Well, we know where the gun is if we need it your call man you don't want to take it anyway should take it anyway i think that that one's probably to leave right let's see is this just like a toilet can we 
can we not? Locked? Yo, my guy. Toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? Absolutely. I, I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Hardy har har. <laughs> Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... You're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... Oh god. Nothing but net. <laughs> You're using that wrong. <laughs> oh. I like Dilly Dee's quite funny. It would be a pain to be around all the time huh. though. Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. What is that? Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... <gasps> Secret door? What is it? Uh, Brian? Whoa, what the fuck? These monitors, this is the camp. Uh-huh. Hmm. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, no, no, he can't be. Bears? They're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids, unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? Like, uh, Bigfoot sighting, you know, that kind of thing. <laughs> Interested. Uh, maybe he listens to that podcast machine so he wasn't... So he was looking for Bigfoot. So, okay. I'm going to upgrade Mr. H from super creepy pervert with a spy cam to, you know, super crazy conspiracy hunter. To be fair, Bigfoot's not a conspiracy. Okay, fine. How about an aspiring cryptozoologist? Hey, maybe he likes the <laughs> podcast that you listen to. Sure, yeah, let's go with that. <clears throat> okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Yeah, it's a bit weird. Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just... Ryan! You know, by stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it, it's weird. It's majorly yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but it, it's it's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure, that won't be an awkward conversation, like at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I I'm leaving the secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. Let's have a look around. There's a microphone there. Okay. What was that? <gasps> it's a person. It's not a bear, it's a person. I'll turn in the camera off. It's probably nothing. Is that what's gonna get us? Is that all you got to say about that? Huh? Map? Scrapyard? Tickets? Anything else? I think that's probably it then. Can we keep looking around? Maybe she shut the door? Ah, this guitar. Okay. Um, so... Anything 
interesting. Is that it? Is that like everything that's in here? Nothing here. What's in here? Just his bathroom. Whoa, there's some pretty heavy duty stuff in here. Yeah, maybe let's not touch that. Yeah, there's nothing fun. So that. Um, well, I think we're good then. Do you think we should go down? Or is it just this? Do you not want to explore what's... Oh. Um... Caitlin, activities coordinator, Emma, theatre coach, Laura, that never showed up, first aid support, wildlife training, oh. Dylan, announcements and scheduling, Abigail, art tutor, Nicholas, cook, kitchen supervisor, which one was Nicholas? Uh, Max, activities assistant, Ryan, sailing coach. Um, up next page. Uh, Jacob, sports coach, shared no, shared no share responsibilities among remaining counsellors. Okay. Well, I think that's probably it then. You sure you don't want to take the gun? Yo, leave the gun alone, man. You got it, boss. Are you sure you don't want to take that? Maybe we'll come back to it later then. Um Nice. Full up. A A twenty eight percent that's full. Is that enough? Should we head to the party? I think I've explored everything. Hey Dunzo. Alright, cool, let's go. Thank you. So does Ryan kind of low-key love Mr. H then? Nick. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, we've not really seen it's Nick. It's a lot easier okay. with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. You can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. <laughs> they always seem to listen to you during painting class. Are these two seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Okay. Which way should we go? Why don't you choose? Sure. Shady Glade, Rocky Road. Rocky Road sounds a little dangerous. Should we go Shady Glade? Let's go this way. I don't know, six and two threes to me. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Jeebus. Oh, my God, are you okay? I'll be okay. <laughs> Come on, I'll spot you. You're gonna let us slide down? I don't know which way is back to camp. Should we go off the beaten path or like what? Just have like a little bit of a look around just in case there's like any clues or anything. Yeah, it's really hard to like, first time going through these games, it's really hard to like know how much time you've got to explore things. Like um, if you can, like if you're missing stuff or like what, I feel like I'm going to get lost. Random box? Huh. Ranger Hi. box. Uh, a box in the woods unlocked inside 
is a change of clothes, Bob Waters, supplies, provisions for a ranger, perhaps the Dillies would even have a ranger. Take it. I think it's a ranger box. Oh. Like a supply <clears throat> cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods. Naked rangers? <laughs> so it would seem. <laughs> <laughs> Is that just like a uniform in there? Where did we even come down? I'm lost already. Yeah, the music's quite pleasant actually. We haven't found a tarot card in a while. Feels like anyway. Where did we come in? Abigail, do you know where we're going? Because I don't. Oh, see, there's something here. What is it? Is that one of the cameras? Is that a camera? Yeah. Maybe it's for the wildlife? Yeah. Trail cam. Makes sense. Um, a trail cam camera hidden in the trees is security measure perhaps up or maybe they're tracking something can we uh trail cameras are rather camp are controlled by chris hackett from a secret room in his office it's like he's looking for something uh -huh. wonder what okay cool um which way do we need to go So, um, I heard this joke about artists. It's pretty bad. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You want to hear it? Sure. Okay. Here it is. Why couldn't the world's fastest painter ever keep a girlfriend? Hmm, why not? Because he always finished in one stroke. Oh, my God. It's, why is it with um, the sorry, guys in this? Isn't that about golfers? Because of the stroke thing? Yeah, sorry. I don't know. <laughs> Jacob probably heard it from his campers. That makes so much sense. Those kids have filthy minds. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! Just a bird. God. Just a bird. Oh, I'm Stop. so sorry. I've just been on a little... Just been a little edgy lately. <laughs> Why? Why have you been edgy, Abigail? Reassuring, curious. I'm kind of curious. Why? Why? It's probably nothing, but ever since the campers left, I've had this weird feeling that there's someone else out there. Like, mm -hmm. watching us. Like, Spooky. There are still campers here? No. No, it's, you know, just the little hairs in the back of my neck standing up, you know? Yeah. Well, it's probably nothing. Right. You're right. Okay. Um, this way? Ah, oh, this the box. Um, maybe this way? This way? Maybe. Someone definitely is watching us, aren't they? What are these angles? I think we're back near the path again. Okay. So these two, like, uh, I know where thing. we are. Yeah. Pack it, Corey. She wants to do a little sketch. This view is just wow. Do you have time to do this, Abigail? Oh. He's like, "Why are you looking at lady?" Oh, let's see. He's orange. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, let's be sincere. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I just... don't know what. You'll figure it out. Is something going to attack them? Did you hear that? Hmm? Oh god, it's something definitely nothing. is there. Hey, listen, there's something there. A pig? Ah, it's so cute! Don't go near it. Look! Oh, it's so tiny. Yeah, but the mother's close. Don't go near it, Abby, girl. I bet oh the mum is so close. Adorable. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Save Abby. <laughs> hold ya. Will there be nearby? Don't breathe. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. <laughs> Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing, tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. No. When the danger is past, run. Pick the right moment okay. and run for your life. <laughs> Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. Oh no. How can you hold your breath for that long? Jeebus. I didn't know when it was okay to release it. Didn't know whether he was gonna pass out. He almost just mowed me to death. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Could he have got mowed to death then? <laughs> yeah, the mother's always close to babies. It's actually a bull. Cheerful. Let's just be cheerful. At least we gave her a good story to tell her pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? I got a pretty good look. Ew. I think she was coming on to me. Oh, got yourself a little girlfriend. She wasn't that little. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get back to camp. Let's get around other people. Let's all, you know, get together again. That pad did not look like it was going to fit into our bag then. Guess we should head back. Yes. It's getting dark, guys. Why would you not be, like, wanting to get back a little quicker? Caitlin. No signal. I finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick.
Can't zoom in. Can't zoom in. Nope. I don't know, was that what we were supposed to take a picture of? Hey Caitlin, guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has <laughs> hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa now, back up, what? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? No. Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Uh, weird light in the treehouse. What's that? Uh, I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Brian. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Are you done? <laughs> you know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. <laughs> oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. <laughs> the made that. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Um, are you both okay? Uh, are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. It wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Special delivery. <laughs> Is that everyone here? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell did that gun come Dude, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh. Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. <laughs> and, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. Melons no and out of yes, date snacks. Way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. I didn't even know you could still find these anywhere. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. That's just a waste of bullets. No, dude. Absolutely not. No. Not leaving you with a gun, not a great idea. It's dead. Okay, there is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? They're out of date anyway. Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! God, he Jake, should not have gun. a gun. No. And nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah. Guess we're going to have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, <laughs> oh. we'll be good. <laughs> oh, wow, these people. So, just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row. I feel like he's going to be terrible. Just let you know that your goose is cooked, Nick. But if you back down now, 
I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you'd actually- Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes, got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. She's a strict one. Right, so Fair play. Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. <laughs> bye, bye. So, um, how's your little one on one with Abby in the woods? Um, it was okay. It was. It was okay. Hey, attaboy! So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah? Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 no. Hey, look, no sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Oh, my God. Jacob. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Capiche. Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Combat. I'm sorry to have to say, there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry where you'll have to defend yourself using potentially deadly force. Okay. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Okay. Take note, if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread, and injuries may not be fatal. There's a time and place for the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Remember, it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. Okay. Okay, so let's have a go. Ops. Oh god, that's quite... Ah. Alright, Nick! One point! Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay. Thank you, good. It's kind of a waste of what, my All right, Nick. This time for real. Okay. Let's do this. So. Nice shot. Thanks. Do a what, my Lucky. How is that lucky? It's a very uh, sensitive. Point to you, Nick. Good like job, the Nick. aiming is very like sensitive. Right. Let's see what you got. He's gonna miss in me. All right, <laughs> you might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right, just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Oh, I thought you were an ultra elite <laughs> pro mark. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, now whoa, with a whoa, 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 Jacob! Someone shot. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey, <laughs> disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Good game, Bob Pop Steam. Sure, glow. He would glow. Ooh, what's that, Jakey? Huh? Huh? Pop, pop. Peanut butter, butter. Pops. Hey, I get it. I get it. Jacob doesn't like losing. Blam, we thought this was over. What the what? Get it, Caitlin. 
Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> All of this is like expired stacks as well. That sounds so gross, actually. Okay, so we're done with the games. Ryan! Is Ryan the only one we haven't played as yet? That is a big moon. Okay. Is this way it's gonna start going downhill? Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Come on, people, we might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Oh, God. Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Right, yeah. <laughs> yes. So we can, like make people kiss if they choose dare yeah as long as everyone consents of course cool beans i mean keep it in your pants until it's your turn but well who does get to go first well it's house steals so abigail truth or dare um true you really dodged a bullet huh all right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I, uh, I, interrupt, should we? Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on, I, I'm not finished. Um, have you ever slept with anyone? at this camp. <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, oh, Abby, oh my God. God, just pick someone. Okay, okay. Um, She's obviously very shy I putting her on the, sh on the spot. <laughs> Ugh, ding, 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 too late. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Um, dare. Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Oh. Can't you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlin or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry. Did it. I don't make the rules. And you literally <laughs> just did, but okay. Let's do this. We had a little flight moment with Dylan earlier on and he Ryan was interested, so let's go with Dylan. Dylan, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Adorable. Always happy to please. <laughs> Woo! I feel like it would be more awkward with Caitlyn. I don't think Caitlyn likes All Ryan, does she? Alrighty, who shall I pick? Or have I just oh, missed something uh, there? Me Jacob haven't got no turn yet. Good point. Um, go on then, Jacob. All right, Jacob. Let's see what you're made of. Oh, there. There, man, come on. Okay. I dare you to take a flying leap over that fire pit. <laughs> Naked. Oh, dude! <laughs> Fuck yes! Oh, I will jump over this thing. I don't care. God, Jacob. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. We're going to have, like, a QTA. No, no, Jacob. Wait. Don't do it. 
Stop. Dude, I say veto. You're gonna fuck yourself up. What? No, come on, man. I got this. Brian, come on. Fine, Vito. You know what? Fuck this game. All right. <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. <clears throat> Whatever. Ah. <laughs> Emma. There. Um. Emma, so you have to kiss. Jacob? Or. Oh. Nick. Uh. Ah, oh, that's a dick move. <laughs> well then. Um. Uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. No. Oh, um, Nick. Nah, this is a dick move. I don't like this. M. Seriously? Like Abigail. Guys. Aww. Guys. Thank you, Nick. It's a bit of a dick move. He's good. Yeah, you shouldn't say that, Emma. Like, you know how she feels about Nick as well. You're like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It was just a game. Hey, I'm nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was? It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man! Yeah, Caitlyn, that Jacob, was like, not a smart up. move. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. Mm. So, anybody want to play Bargeezy? What? Yeah, not the best, um, move. Oh, are these who's been watching us? Jedediah? Fuck this. <laughs> I am, as always, delighted that you're here. Thank you. So, then, what more has been found? We haven't found any tarot cards. So you return we without him. any more of my cards. Yet you return nonetheless. Why is that, do you think? I don't know. I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. Sorry, lady. Please, my friend. That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again. You can count on that. Okay, dokie. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Maybe there was another tarot card like in them woods or unless we went on the rocky road way. But I feel like you have to play these games like multiple times anyway. Chapter 3, Trouble in Paradise. You got that right. Yeah, I did like that. That's a dick move on Caitlyn. And then she's just gone off in the woods. Like, not a smart move either. What are we in middle school? Why should I even care? Anybody can kiss anybody. It's stupid. It's stupid. Great. Where the hell am I? You numpty. I don't know where you are. Immediately goes off the path. Okay. Okay. Is that something over there? This little bit of grass looks bright. Yeah, I kind of like. I don't want to miss stuff, but I know that I'm gonna like miss. Huh? I can't. 
go that way. Yeah, like the cards and stuff, we've obviously missed some... Well, we've obviously missed one at least. In that previous chapter. So what is the, like, one or two per chapter? Maybe? But we can explore this area, so there's probably something around here as well. Spooky. Oh, that's freaky. Oh. Come back. Nick! Abby? Shout again! I'm over here! Coming! Nick! Hey. Hey. Um. Hi. You are. Oh, that You're sounds like something not human. Oh, I wouldn't stop. I'd keep going. I think that game just got a little too intense for me. Hey. Yeah, I know what you mean. Um, I would just be direct. Guess Emma's had a thing for you all along, huh? What? No, 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 no way. She was just trying to make Jacob jealous. I was just playing along. You seem to enjoy playing along. I enjoyed helping Emma make Jacob jealous. That's about it. Move their storyline along a little bit. This kind of sounds like a dog. We made up now. <laughs> Okay, cool. We're gonna get attacked, aren't we? Did you hear that? Mm-hmm. Should we look? Mm-hmm. What is it? Oh my god, what is it? Don't go towards it. I would keep going. Okay, there are the walking off. Okay. Oh, they're gonna get attacked, aren't they? This is it, this is where it's all gonna like go downhill. No? Yeah? I don't think they have anything on them either, either of them. Is it another boar? It doesn't sound too growly. I don't like it. Is it a bear? It's gonna make me jump in there. What is it? What the hell? Uh, run, Abby. Gail. Burning! Help him? Oh god, he's in the background. He's in the background. Ah oh, no! No, Abigail, that was probably the wrong choice then. Oh. She just leaves him anyway. She just leaves him anyway. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Run or hide? How would just keep running? That's probably not the right thing. I should have probably had, like, hid. Oh, 
god, oh god, oh god, okay. That was a long one. Was this just like the QTE option? Oh, please don't die, Abby, girl. Climb a tree? I don't think that would help. Like, just keep going, maybe. Oh god, we're probably gonna get killed. Ah, oh, my god, Miguel, I'm so sorry. I feel like she's gonna die. So she's hiding anyway, she's gonna die. What is it? Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Don't like it. What is it? Maybe we should have had. It's a fun game. I want to stop by. Stupid flicker like You regretting the sabotage in the car, Jacob? You numpty. Well, I feel like that's Nick and Abigail dead. <laughs> Bloop. That's green. Technique needs work. Hey. Uh, yeah. I guess you found that. Of course. <sighs> Sneaking down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, was just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. I know, I just... Got attached. You just love having an audience, huh? <laughs> Jacob. I mean, you do, I can't believe you, the, you fucking Frenched him. <laughs> you know, in front of everyone. Jesus wept. Frenched, are we 12? No, but Nick is. Kind of. <laughs> you know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. <laughs> okay, Emma? You, you really love fucking with me, huh? Lighten up, Sourpuss, please. This is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No Nothing, never mind. Hey, that's mine. Yeah, well, finders keepers. I'm getting it back tomorrow. Why is that path updated? Fine. You can stand here, sulking. Driving yourself crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Ah, oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Some are fun, right? Apparently, summer is not quite over. You're gonna go into the lake now? 
Okay. Really? No, thank you. There's gonna be something in there, isn't there? Oh God. Who is that? Just a random body. Oh, that's the um, thingy stuff from the car. Numpty. have a look around star we actually found one um oh it's the stars uh stars in the night sky at beacons of light dreams of hope purpose or a reminder of our insignificance fear or dis fear of despair trust in the light of the star with it comes clarity and sometimes proof yeah we've missed one it's a little annoying no swimming sign without supervision. A handmade, I was going to say a handsome sign then. A handmade sign warning people off of swimming near the boathouse. How dangerous can a lake be? I bet very dangerous. We'll see about that. God, where's the little sausage? Anything down here? Random box. Nothing in it, no. What's this? What's this red thing? Just a packet of crisps. Check it and thack it, huh? Oh, well, check it must mean Mr. H. Chris Hackett. Let's have a look. A faded cam photograph from the 1970s. According to the names printed below, two of the boys in the picture appear to be Hackett's. Who the hell is Thackett? I don't know. I don't know, Jacob. Who is like it? <laughs> oh god, it's dark. Ah, oh, I've come out of the bear house. Let's just have a look see if there's anything on the other side then. God, and that body's just been in there this whole time. Not long ago. Four months. A recent newspaper article about two hikers who went missing in these woods. As of as of the day of publication, they haven't been found. Two hikers, do you think that's the two backpacks that were in the um wonder if it was near here? You know those two backpacks that Emma found? Do we need to go upstairs then? Okay. Yeah, maybe it was those two. And they've been eaten, that's why they've not been found. Ah, I can't believe both of those got bitten. Must be some like werewolf type thing, right? towels hmm. be what vigilant manageable but what did that even say a huh. uh, bit has log book uh, manageable but unsustainable sailing rules uh, reminder for counselors keep all boats rinsed after use no swimming Properly store boats to avoid damage. All campers must wear life jackets. If boat capsized, remove kids from the lake immediately. Do not jump in after them. Sail over and retrieve from water. It really does not want you to go into the water. Binoculars. Was that one of them things? Someone up there. So there's multiple? Yeah, I'm gonna go with probably everything's fine. Everything is not fine, Jacob. You should have stayed inside. 
So I'm assuming this is where the towels are supposed to be. God damn it. God damn it. Yeah. There's no towels. None? There's exactly zero. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say uh, going for a little dip is not a good idea at all. Find a tarot card then. The lady will be happy with us. Where is she? Okay. Okay, well, I guess we could just like drip dry or you know, could shake it out doggy style. Well, He's definitely really not looking at his face. Girl, don't you? Face. Well, <laughs> Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. Oh, but I can because you see, oh, help! Help! I'm I'm drowning and I I need a big, strong not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> Let's just be enthusiastic. Okay. What's this? A female in need? Fear not, <laughs> fragile thing, for Hurricane Jake is here! Hurricane Jake? Oh, oh, oh. Cold, cold, cold. I believe oh, cold. cold. Hurricane Jake. It's not the promised land, but I'm sure this room is planned. Oh, okay. Okay, now you're gonna get it. See? <laughs> <laughs> hey! Switch! Oh, stop being a uh, drunk! Splash. Uh, attack! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, is he gonna see the body? Sentimental. Let's go sentimental. Look, I don't want this to end. <laughs> I'd be happy to stay out here all summer, but I think we'd get a little prune. Oh, you know what I mean. Like, I mean this. I'm not sure I say we great summer with you. Well, it doesn't just have to be the summer. <laughs> okay, oh, look, how about this? Um, <clears throat> if I can do a backflip off of here, you let me come visit you, okay? How about that? Right. Hey! Where are you going? Come on! She's just gonna swim off. Huh? Oh god. Was that Abigail? How did that end up in the wall? Was that not in his, um, well, we need that. Otherwise the car isn't going to start, right? Jacob? I think Abby's oh, a godder anyway. Dick. Are we even going to be able to find it? Barbed wire? Oh god. Oh god, that'd be so awful. There it is! Why are all these bits floating then? Crap. Okay, now go back up. Oh god. 
Oh god, oh god. The blade decomposing corpse chained to the bottom of the lake. Oh god. Do you think that was like oh god, I need to stop detangle. I don't think you have time to detangle. Oh, is he gonna die? Is that because he had the bangle on? Oh god, Jacob's dead. Sorry, Jacob. I don't think we're doing very well in this playthrough. Should have detangled. Whoops, I'm so sorry, Jacob. That was some mighty fine social disruption there, Caitlin, I have to say. Ah, or was it just the nudge that Abby needed? You're an evil genius. Who do you think is gonna make the first move? Nick or Abby? Ooh, good cue. My bet's on either. I don't know, Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Hey, don't let that cute, preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> so, you noticed that too, huh? So, what do you guys want to do now? We can keep playing. Just the yeah, three of us? Just the three of us. Alright, Dylan. Truth or... Uh, okay, so that's Abby, Abby, right? Oh my gosh. Uh, we gotta help her. <laughs> Wait, where did it come from? This way. Come on. I can't believe we killed Jacob. Abby! Help! Please! Jacob! Help him! Um. Um, impatient, maybe? Hey! What happened? Abby, what happened? Ryan! We gotta know what. Well, she needs help. Give her a second. Oh. Go after Nick! Go! Um. Okay, I've got this. Okay. I've got this. Oh, I should maybe get this. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful. Oh my god. God, everyone's gonna die, aren't they? Okay. I have a okay. very bad feeling right. about this playthrough. So she's been bit. Oh god. Okay, come on, Ryan, you've got this. Let's try and keep some people alive. Um, um, fill a path, maybe. Oh, God. Oh, God. God, my, maybe Ryan's gonna die. I don't know. Maybe everyone's gonna die. Oh, take shortcut then. Okay. Please be careful, Ryan. Oh, God. Okay. Ah! I was gonna say I nailed them. God. Okay. 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 Please be careful. Please be careful. Nick. <gasps> Who's that? Shout. Hey! Get the fuck off of him! I don't think we should shoot him, like, we could potentially hit Nick with the spread or whatever. Oh god, was that the wrong choice? 
This is the thing about these games, you never know whether you're picking the right other one to receive that. Did you just fight him? He just shot his finger off. Because Nick was bit and he bit him, so he got rid of the limb. So whatever it is doesn't spread. So does that mean Nick's gonna turn? Gotta get, we gotta go. Good walk. Okay, come on, gotta go. Come on, let's get back to the fire. But where did Nick get bit? And he's like, well, I think got bit there, so we can't, like, what, chop her head off? <laughs> oh. Yeah, we didn't do very well in that Seems chapter. Like just a blink, and you're back to see me again. I got caught this time, lady. So. Then, what have we got? A card. It's the star. Mm -hmm. Stars, stars in the night, sky, beacons of light, dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificance, fear of despair. Trust in the light of the star, with it comes clarity, and sometimes truth. Remember, there's always more than meets the eye. Would you like me to show you? Yeah, sure. Even though it never ever makes any sense. But why not? Back to it then. Back to Hackett's Quarry. Back to Hackett's Quarry you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. Mm hmm But that is where we're going to leave this episode. Um, oh God, I feel like we did terrible. Uh, by we, I mean me. I uh, did terrible in that one. So Nick got bit. Abigail got bit. Jacob's drowned. Oh god, it's it's gonna be a disaster. So if, cause that guy shot his finger off. So does that mean that if they get bit, if it's on a limb or whatever, to cut it off, get rid of it? I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this uh, playthrough. Uh, play your bets now. Who's gonna survive? Who isn't? And yes, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. Bye, everyone. <laughs>